Okay, what's going on everybody? Wazoo pregame video. This is a game that I think could get really close in the first half. And I mean, I mean like, exchanging touchdowns close. Because we're banged up on the offensive line. Um, they always play us close. All the time. They are always kind of that one team, uh, along with Cal, that you really don't expect to give you fits and does. Uh, and plus, they are gonna, they're just going to try and throw the ball over the yard. Connor Holiday, last time we played them, threw the ball 89 times. Uh, outrageous the way they throw the ball. Um, it's really going to test our secondary. Not that our secondary isn't up to the task. It's just um, they always play us close for a half. So I'm not going to come out here and say we're just going to blow them out of the water on the road. Uh, it's kind of a weird place to play you. The team stays in Spokane 20 minutes from the stadium. So it's it, it's just kind of um, really different than any other visiting atmosphere, I would say. Um, so for that reason, I'm I'm mildly concerned about an upset here. Um, not a lot of people are thinking it's going to be close, and maybe the team's the same way, though. I think Marcus and Ifo and Hironis Grasu, our center, um, they all came back to win. And they're not going to let a game like this, a game we know we should win by double digits, um, take away our chances at the big picture, or what we really want to get to. And we all know what that is. That's the playoff. Um, but then in the second half, I, c I think we come out and we smoke them. They don't have the depth we do. And I just don't think our, their passing game um, solely is going to be able to keep up with our dual threat, just crazy offense. Their their defense isn't that great. I mean, they they lost to Nevada and they've lost to Rutgers. Um, so those are teams that we're better than. So, I mean, I hate to play that game, but we, we really should beat these guys by, by three touchdowns, in my opinion. But we'll see how it goes. It's going to be an interesting game, I think, to see how the team responds now. First road game of the season. Can the young guys step up and make plays? And um, can Thomas Tyner finally get out of a funk? He has been in a funk all year. I think this might be the game to do that, where um, they're kind of, we're going to be, I think, a really balanced attack. So we'll see how that goes. But that's really about it. There's not much to say about Washington State. Um, I'm... I'm excited to see how, like I said, how the boys respond on the road and see if we can come out hot and, you know, put the pedal to the metal early and really not make it a game for a half. But I wouldn't be shocked if, like, when we had them at home a few years ago, excuse me, we had them in CenturyLink and it was a four-point game at half. We ended up winning 56-29, to 29, I think. But we'll see how it goes. I'm... I'm confident we're going to get the win and move on to the bye week, which is bye week could not come at any better time. Um, honestly, this this will be a great bye week. So, as always, guys, go Ducks.